today we are continuing our adventure together. Yes, you and I, we are going from Baniwangi, which is all the way east in Java. Today we're heading more west. So let's see where the plans take us and see what amazing things we can find here in East Java. Let's start our journey. Let's go. And with a full tank of gas and a ton of excitement after finally making it to the island of Java, we were now heading to a beautiful magical forest with the name of the Jawatan. Okay guys, so I've made it. Look at this. I gotta love the parking area. It's really beautiful. It like sets the standard. So the ticket is 12,000. Well, the ticket itself is 10,000, but parking is 2,000 if you have a bike. And since I have a bike, there we go. <laughs> so we're about to head inside, see if it's uh, worth the 10,000. And by looking at the pictures, I really think so. And as soon as I got inside, I was transported to a magical, magical place. Hey guys, so it is like I'm walking into a fairy tale right now. <laughs> wow, it's it's actually really beautiful. I wonder like how all these trees are and how long it must have taken, but it must have taken an insanely long amount of time. Okay, so it turns out this place is a place that got a little bit famous after a lot of famous people. That took pictures here. Don't, please don't ask me who. I just Google translated because like no information is available on this place, and it's it's a shame because like I, yeah, I mean obviously I haven't seen any other foreigners here. Like there's a lot of local schools and and people coming from about other places, but as of now we got this place to ourselves, and it feels incredible. Like it's like I'm walking through a fairy tale place, and it's uh, it looks amazing. It looks like I'm getting a ton of attention from people around here. Like they haven't seen too many foreigners around here, which is understandable. And uh, guys, check this out. It looks amazing. The more time that I spent at the Javatan, the more I realized how absolutely incredible this place is. This is an incredible place. If you want to do photo shoots, if you just want to hang out with friends, I highly, highly recommend you checking out this place. So there's a, a lot of places where you can buy coconuts and ice cream and stuff here. And for a day like this, where it's insanely hot and it's like midday as well, when the sun is the most intense, I'm really happy I'm in a place where there's a lot of shade. And I see someone's renting out ATVs. That does seem kind of tempting, doesn't it? <laughs> okay, I can't help it, guys. It's only 30,000 Indonesian rupiah to go with the ATV so I'm gonna do it fuck it I'm still gonna do it it's like if I get the chance to do that in such a place as this then I, I gotta do it I gotta do it so what do you get when you mix an inexperienced driver with a motorized vehicle right answer is fun let's do this <laughs> like that okay here we are we're doing it guys doing it. <laughs> That's insane. Let's just say things got a little bit out of hand after this. Wow. Welcome to East Java. So I, I deliver the bike by doing a donut here in the park. And uh, yeah, that, that, was, that, was, that was worth it. That was worth the 30K. N zero doubt, like absolute zero doubt. <laughs> I gotta get myself an ATV now. Like, my God, that was fun. <laughs> and with this being one of the hottest days I've ever experienced while traveling here in Indonesia, a fresh coconut with a little bit of a dance party was exactly what was needed. Too bad there was a lot of copyrighted music because it sounded pretty good. So it has been incredible so far here at Javatan Perutani. Yes, I finally nailed the name and I only had to look at it once. So <laughs> progress has been made. Too bad I'm leaving this place now. Uh, I actually met one person that I'm gonna be traveling with as well. He is praying right now. We're gonna be heading together to some incredible, incredible beaches that I wasn't actually planning on heading to today, but I'm doing it because I am, I have a new travel buddy. Okay, Red Beach, here we come. Let's go. 
After only about a one hour drive from central Banyuwangi, we are now heading down to the south along the coastline where we got a little bit crazy along the way because we were excited as we were heading to one of the most beautiful beaches known as the Red Beach, which is a beautiful beach that stretches for multiple kilometers and the color of the water is absolutely pristine. So there was only one thing to do, get absolutely mind blown by this beautiful, beautiful region. Like, I don't see anyone else here. Like, I think I see someone like, all the way at the edge there, but this part, we're all alone. And after a long day in the sun, it was finally time to experience the silky smooth water and run down cinematically on the beach like I'm in Baywatch. And after being extremely happy that I decided to bring my hammock, the day was coming to a close and I was feeling extremely grateful that I had chosen to go on this massive trip to Java. Banyuwangi is such a beautiful region that I can highly recommend to the people out there loving nature and for some of the most incredible sunsets I've ever seen. For you guys, don't forget, if you have a chance, just come to Banyuwangi. It's incredibly amazing. Sampai jumpa! I'm going to be posting a ton of content in the coming months ahead, so make sure you subscribe because I will have a lot of killer content for you guys. And thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Peace out!